Today, we have a very exciting topic to discuss. And as you can see from the title, it is how to attract wealthy men. Now, when I say wealthy men, I don't mean in terms of what they have in their bank accounts, okay? I mean good men in terms of character, all right? I am saying this because a man can be rich when it comes to what he has in his bank account, but not necessarily rich in character. To me, that is what is the ultimate goal and that is what everyone should you know aspire to have a good man in terms of character if you get what i mean now attracting the right partner is what some people struggle with now i'm going to walk you through some tips on how to attract good men let's get started hi guys Thank you so much for coming back to our channel. If you're new here, hello, my name is Eber and I'm so happy to have you here. So I'm gonna start by saying that it's okay if there's no man right now. The first and foremost is to work on your self-confidence. Yes, confidence is key when it comes to attracting good men. Value yourself, carry yourself with pride and grace and as a queen that you are <laughs> always believe in yourself and your worth all right embrace your strengths and work on areas where you may feel insecure all right now remember confidence is very attractive <laughs> and can make you stand out in a crowd always stay true to yourself try not to be like someone else because there's no one you should rather be than who you are okay there's no one who can be like you now remember that authenticity is very attractive and attract men who appreciate you for who you are always embrace yourself and everything that makes you you including your flaws take care of yourself good men are attracted to women who are always taking care of themselves it's as simple as that okay always take care of yourself physically mentally and emotionally you don't want to be broken when the right man comes knocking on your heart if you have a broken heart from a past relationship you should try to mend that before the good man or the mr right comes knocking okay so that you don't transfer aggression from your past relationship to the good man okay you want to make sure that you always take care of yourself your mind your body your spirit all right um when it comes to mental health um you can always read books that are rich i'm going to recommend one for you okay atomic habits you should read that book okay if, if these days therapy classes if they're very expensive so i wouldn't really recommend a one-on-one -on -one section with uh, um, a professional therapist okay but you can try to read up books or mental exercises i'm going to recommend another one as well fabulous okay it's an application that has helped me so much to attain my mental health goal i don't know just anything like that okay so i'm going to drop it somewhere here okay so you can download the app it's going to be useful for you it's if you're someone who is struggling, who is always struggling with your mental health, you don't want to be always disorganized, okay? You want to make sure that you're always, you know, in your clear mind, clear sense, so that you can even be able to fathom when your good man comes knocking. <laughs> so you should also prioritize um, self-care activities like exercising. You don't need to always go to the gym. If you're just starting out, you can always do that at home. 30 minutes of exercise can help in improving your mood for that day. This not only targets your body, it also helps to improve your mental health. Okay, so you don't, you won't always be depressed if you're exercising. It has worked for me, all right? Yeah. Getting enough sleep eight hours a night, even though I don't always do that, <laughs> but it's recommended, okay? It, when you take care of yourself, what this does is it shows that you value yourself and that is attractive to wealthy men. 
now good men are attracted to women who are mostly positive okay okay having a, a positive mindset is, is very crucial okay and meeting your mr right <laughs> you want to make sure that you let go of any negativity from your past relationships focus on the future the past has passed away and the future is in front of you so what are you going to make of it okay you can meet good men in your sitting room <laughs> now meeting new people is a great way to increase your chances of meeting good men okay so you need to join social activities attend events and even try out new hobbies where you can meet like-minded people the trick is the more people you meet the more chances of you meeting people who share the same interests and values just like you okay you you want to make sure that you are always open to conversations with new people well not everyone but people who you think might share the same values and interests just like you creating an approachable vibe can make good men feel comfortable approaching you it's good that you establish your worth and have clear boundaries when it comes to your relationships it's good that you always set boundaries okay so people don't just take you for a ride all right don't settle for less and hold on to your standards and by setting boundaries i mean you should set healthy and realistic boundaries all right focus on building a healthy life you need to work on building a healthy life that brings you joy and fulfillment outside of a romantic relationship independently of that okay now you need to be able to be fulfilled within yourself outside the relationship what i mean by that is you know good men are attracted to women who have passions goals and aspirations live a life that makes you happy and a real man a good man will want to be a part of it and finally be patient okay attracting a man doesn't take time but attracting a good man takes a whole lot of time Okay? Don't rush into a relationship and don't settle for less than you deserve. Just trust the process, focus on yourself and be patient. Your Mr. Right is going to walk into your life at the right time. These tips are meant to guide you. The most important thing is to stay true to yourself and enjoy the journey of finding love. Now I have another video of where I shared 5 things that women wish men knew about sex. You should check that out and that will be all for now thank you so much for watching if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and consider joining the family by subscribing to our channel for more helpful content like this remember that you're worthy of love and you deserve a great man see you next time bye